Hello, I'm Junius Abdurrahman Suleiman uh, from Refugee Sport Network. So nice to meet you today here in Kakumoko. Thank you. Uh, so even me, nice to meet you. Good. So what's your name? My name is Port Pool Cook. Port Pool eh? Cook. Yes. So uh, Port. So I will wish uh, just uh, to hear from you about the game of the day uh, that you have been seeing, and kindly you may tell us a little bit about the game of the day. Yeah, today is our home, our first game okay. of Kakuma Premier League. Yeah. As a benefit, mm -hmm. we are hosting Nas Boy okay. uh, from the other side of Kakuma One. Mm -hmm. So it is our first game today uh, to start uh, the big. Thank you. And uh, from the from your observation between the both teams, eh? so which team will you think that will maybe will win against the other team? Yeah. Football is uh, white and black, as we all know. Okay. But since we are playing uh, on our own soil, mm -hmm. we are we are we are prepared enough. We want to win this game so that we it will motivate us for the other game to come. Because it is our first game, uh, we prepare. We want to win the game. But football is white and black. But for us. We have hope that we can win the game, but it depends on the performance. Thank you, thank you so much uh, for your a uh, little bit uh, illustrations, and uh, perhaps also from your uh, also observation as you stated that you are uh, a Benfa fan. And uh, uh, will a Benfa perform or will Benfa uh, win the Cup Premier League, uh, Kakuma Premier League? Yeah, every team participated in the league. They have a hope that they can win. Like us, we have hope that this season we won the title, we won the cup. So uh, perhaps uh, uh, from uh, course we have said that you are well prepared uh, this season and also uh, there may be some of the challenges that face the team or face you as a president of the team. Would you also like also to share some of the challenges that you can face? Uh, of course uh, here in Kapkuma uh, there are a lot of challenges that are facing the team participating in Kapkuma really because the equipment needed for the team to prepare enough, they are not there. There are no enough uh, football boots. Some players they do come and borrow boots from uh, others. If they miss boots in the community, that means that even when they come for the game, they will not be able to play because everyone comes with their own shoes. If you don't come with your shoes, it will be hard for you to play. So a lot of challenges are there. Like ball are not enough. You can even see now we only have one ball. That is the one we use for practice. And for playing game, and we have a good number of players, which may need us to have three or four balls. But currently, we only have one. So I can say there are a lot of challenges in terms of ball and uh, other equipment like uh, corn, deep. Those things are not enough. Currently, currently we are really facing a lot of challenges due to the fact that we don't have a, a constant sponsor that is sponsor our team. So it has been a challenge to us. All right, thank you so much for uh, telling us some or sharing some of the challenges that is facing team currently. And perhaps so I can see uh, a lot of fans. Uh, it is like this is a very big game today. A lot of fans and uh, a lot of guys from Kakuma One, Kakuma Three, Kakuma Four watching the the, the the game of the day. So what will be some of the importance of the sport as from your observation? Yeah, the sport is something good because it brings many people together. It promotes unity. So it is also a source of income for someone who took it as his career. If he advanced to the top league, he can earn something for himself or for his family. So I can say sport is something good to promote unity and also as a source of income. Thank you. Thank you so much for your illustration. And perhaps also don't forget uh, to subscribe at our YouTube channel, which is uh, Refugee Sport Network in Kakuma. So thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you.